Hello everyone, this is Hank. I'm back for another episode about USRP. Specifically, I'm going to talk about the flickering problem and uh, what you can use in the USRP to combat it. Okay, so first, let's talk about what am I talking about. If you ever taking a picture that looks something like what you're seeing on the screen here, and instead you get um, something like this, okay, or that, or that, or that, and then you know that um, you have an issue with flickering. Flickering happens when you're shooting at a certain shutter speed, normally is a higher shutter speed that you worry about, like 1 200 to say 1 1000, something like that. Okay, <clears throat> and you're shooting under fluorescent light. Now, I don't know if you realize that fluorescent light uh, don't generate continuous light, it's actually flickering a lot, so it turn on and off. Now, it, it does that fast enough that the human eyes cannot detect it, so you see it as continuous. But the camera, uh, especially with the high shutter speed, it, it can pick it up. And you have a really serious, ugly looking picture like this, which is almost impossible to fix in post processing. So, uh, Canon has uh, something they call anti flickering. So. Uh, and that helps a lot. Okay, so for example, next picture here, I took same condition with the anti-flicker, and it looks a whole lot better. Um, okay, um, you know when you really compare to this, it looks really, really a lot better. Okay, so with that, let me kind of show you um, where it is in the menu item. Uh, so you go to a menu item, it would be the red one, shoot number six. And you can turn the anti flicker shoot on and off there. Okay, but I'll show you a better way to do this uh, rather than relying on the menu. So basically here um, on the screen, you, you keep hitting the info button until you got a certain amount of display right so this would be my favorite so you just hit enter okay and, and here it allows you um, and then you move around until you get to flicker off okay when you get to this <coughs> there's a couple of, of uh, things that you need to 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 remember the, the the number one would be if you hit the info button this thing will detect for you whether or not you have flickering problem. Right now, I don't have the, um, the fluorescent light on, so it's not detecting, but it will say detected if that. Now, if it's detected, what you want to do is to go to flicker on, hit on, and then you can take a picture, and uh, you will get something like this instead of this. Okay? Um, <clears throat> so that's it um, to combat it. So the next time you run into a situation like this, don't panic, okay? There's nothing really wrong with your camera. Rather, it's the shooting conditions that you are in. So in that case, turn on flicker, and then you'll be done. Thank you very much. If you like it, um, press the like button if you haven't subscribed. I would appreciate very much if you subscribe. Thank you. Bye.